actually realize I was a feminist until recently. Unfortunately, um, I always believed in women and I, I, I guess I just didn't consciously make the decision to identify like, as, a, as a feminist. But um, in, in light of all the recent events, especially with the election in the United States, I started to really think about my role in the arts, especially, and how I can use my work to, to sort of contribute like, to the positive voices and the awareness. And it's really crazy because, like I said, I didn't realize I was a feminist, but looking back, I guess I always was. My mom raised me as a single mother, and looking back, she was the brave one. She's the one that risked everything. She did it all to provide for us. And my father sort of, even though they didn't end in a violent way, they were civil, but he, he chose sort of like this safe, scared path. So he followed whatever the traditional like Russian way was supposed to be, you know, he was just working quietly. He didn't make um, he didn't make a lot of noise. And my mom was always like stirring things up. She always wanted change, and and so I think her influence, her being bold, her be being willing to leave everything for a better life, really inspired me. And then looking like I didn't realize it at the time, but then when I look back now, I guess the fact that I was able to is you know be a business owner be an independent artist all those things were influenced by her resistance to her society at the time and i think it wasn't so much like the russian i know there's a lot of uh, you know things happening in russia right now but i think in the time that i grew up women were kind of running the show they were working they were they were making things happen a lot of single mothers were providing for their children in ways that men couldn't even just based on their drive and passion. So all those things really influenced me. Um, and I, I guess I channeled that energy into my work now. And what actually, on the other hand, what started happening was when I started my magazine, a lot of the artists we were publishing were actually women. And I started to get a lot of negative feedback about it. Why are you only featuring women? I started to get called a sexist and I started to get a, a lot of trolls which made me actually want to do it more because I felt like it, this was a button that was pushed, you know, on, on whatever circle I was in. And I thought that that trigger meant that there was something wrong and people were getting upset about it. So I actually work predominantly with women curators who help select the work for the magazine. And we still feature men, but we don't, you know, obviously those those negative comments didn't make me turn around and not do it they just inspired me to see how i can keep pushing this forward and, and create more opportunities for women